Hey guys, M2 Collector here with another video, this time bringing you uh, one of those videos where we're talking about variants or running changes or errors, whatever the case may be, the terms are interchangeable. I talked to a buddy that's kind of, you know, in the industry and, and kind of knows about these things. Um, they're all the same thing, factory error, running change, variant, it's all semantics and doesn't matter either way, uh, whatever the case may be. So we know that um, Cobra Trooper Classified Series G.I. Joe, um, there is a blue color version and there is a black color version, black color, blue color. Now one of the other running changes, variants, factory errors, whatever you want to call it, um, there is a version which has a black hip piece. Um, and I noticed that the eyes are actually different color compared to the other Cobra Troopers. So I want to talk about the differences with it. Now, understand that in this video, I'm not saying this is some kind of true variant um, or anything like that. It's just one of those things that for whatever reason, the production runs of these particular items, whether it was at one factory, a different factory, or at one time and then at a later time, whatever the case may be, they are truly, in fact, have small little differences. Does it matter? No, it really doesn't. Why do I have all three? Because I'm stupid and just wanted to get a, a one of each different version. It's an army builder anyway. Now I have a mini army having three different Cobra Troopers. So in this video, again, I am going to show you the difference between the blue collar, black collar, which I have done a video about already, so I'll go over it quickly. But really, it's going to be highlighting this one here in the center, which is one that has actually only shown up in Canada. Why Canada and nowhere else, not even in the Asian markets, from what I can understand um, and anything like that. But only in Canada did this one appear. So shout out to my good buddy, Quinn. He runs um, SpookyBarnToys.com. He actually had a couple of Cobra Troopers, and he got one with the black hit piece. So I actually traded him uh, one with, you know, where the pants and the legs are all blue because uh, he actually prefers that look. And I agree, it's a better look. Uh, but he traded one of his with the black crotch piece um, for one of the other Cobra Troopers that I was able to get through Target since they had, you know, they'd done the re-releases. So um, let's get these, this one out of the box. Well, let's get them all out of the box. I haven't opened this one yet, but let's get them out of the box. And um, we'll briefly kind of talk about it. The accessories are all the same. For the most part, everything's the same, except, of course, the eye color on this one is a little bit different and then that hit piece is a different color but yes it doesn't look as good i think it was uh, ruckus he had said something about uh the black diaper piece or whatever it just doesn't look right and yeah it looks a little funky but you know it changes things up if you're looking at an army builder it's nice to have some kind of different variation if we're not going to do the heads yes you could do one with a helmet without a helmet with the goggles on without the goggles whatever the case may be but it's nice that there's some actual difference in its full-on appearance I guess if that makes sense um, so let's get right to it okay so I have the three troopers out of the package here we have the black color here we have the blue color I need I've seen a lot of people kind of go around and say oh which one came out first kind of like be the beachhead right which was first the brown eyes or the blue eyes and it, there was no real first they kind of came out at the same time you either got one with the blue color or you got one with the black color um, the boxes actually had the same lot numbers and everything, so I, I, I don't even know how to necessarily differentiate from it, but on the bottom of the box, you'll see that there's the imprinted number, so on the black collar, blue collar, it's 01791. Now, on the new package that has been going out into Canada, like Toys R Us out there, the imprinted number on the bottom is 01531. So that lot number is different. And again, the big difference with this one is that it has um, different color eyes. These ones are kind of like a vibrant brown or almost like a reddish color, whereas the other two seem like a light brown. That could be just um, a, a pretty negligible difference, unlike Beachhead where blue was bright blue, brown was clearly brown, and then the new one, which is kind of a grayish color, but we're not gonna talk about that. I think I did a video on that. Did I do a video on that? I may not have done a video on that. Um, but the the trooper, this trooper, I just really wanted to do the video on this because I had done those other previous videos on the, the, the differences, the changes, the variants, whatever the hell it is, whatever the hell is going on, factory error, whatever, whatever. Um, so the key thing again here is the hip crotch piece. So if you see here, all blue pants, all blue pants, and then here, for whatever reason, that came out black. 
Don't really know why, but it is a difference, and I'm like, okay, you know what, why not get my hands on one of those? It's just, it's so odd that only Canada got it. I thought for sure when the Target um, restocks, the, the reissues were going to happen, that this would be the version that would come out, because it seemed like this was the most recent production run, but... That was not the case. We still got, um, it, it, I think, a mixture of blue collar and black collar actually in that in, in that run. Now, I've heard folks say that those have all been sitting out on a dock somewhere because of all the backlog of shipments and containers and all these different ports and everything. I don't know how true that is. It is very possible, uh, but I would imagine that after a year that some of that would have gone through. Now, unless Target had been sitting on it, for many months waiting for this reissue event, then yeah, it could absolutely make sense. But I don't actually know the answer there. But the figures are the same, so again, the only difference is he has a, a brighter brown eyes, almost a red in color, um, but that hip piece uh, being black. So if you look at the back of the figure, it definitely looks kind of funky, because it's like, whoa, what the hell's going on there? Why would that just that portion of his pants look black? Um, it doesn't look... It, it doesn't look that good when you really turn the figure around. You know, the pants should all be one color, but for whatever reason, it is what it is there. Um, yeah, if I shine some light, it just looks, it just does look a little bit funky, you know, especially now having it in hand. Um, it's still something, you know, that it's different. I, I still definitely wanted to have it. It's just really weird. And then the other weird part like on top of that it's not like that hip piece was just like molded in black plastic it was painted black because if you look on the inside if i can get a uh, bright enough light in there which it doesn't look like i'm going to be able to do it's actually still blue in there so they just painted the outside black like what was what was the reason for that I, I don't I don't know so if you see there it's just it's painted black because it's blue on the inside there so it's definitely something where somebody or something happened where they thought oh well this is supposed to be black color because of the vest and everything comes down um, but it's just really 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 odd I can't even really explain it but you guys let me know down in the comments below what you think of it do you hate the way it looks I don't like the way it looks, but it's just one of those little changes, one of those little differences. It helps differentiate between all these different troopers as you're doing an army build. Um, for me, I don't mind it. I, I, you know, I definitely sought it out because I wanted to see what was going on. It, it, the whole thing with all these differences, it, it intrigues me a little bit. Um, but this is not something where people need to get all crazy for. I completely understand that it's stupid. Like, why does it matter? Because it really doesn't. To me, it holds a little significance, but for others, I completely get it, right? Who gives a shit what color, color he has, whether it's blue or black? Who cares? What does it matter? It doesn't. For me, though, I just, again, I wanted to have one of each. I think it's, it's kind of cool having one of each and each one being just a little bit different. Okay, so here's a close-up look at the eye color. As you can see, you can really see that brownish-red color um, in those eyes. And we look at like the other U.S. released ones, either blue color or black color. As the eyes are a much tame, uh, lighter brown color, as you can see there. So, again, much brighter brown or red color, light brown there. And then this is the blue color, black color. Again, same eye color between these two, so there is no difference. It is strictly just the blue paint added to the collar, whereas this one does not have the blue paint added. Then now the third one with that different eye color, and again, hit piece there. So crazy stuff. I love this figure. The Cobra Trooper was one of my top figures of 2020. Um, you guys let me know down in the comments below. What do you feel about these weird little things that Hasbro has going on? Do you think it's a case of... Uh, the different factories, miscommunication, people messing up, whatever the case may be. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Uh, if you guys like this video, please do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. And as always, thank you for watching.